We are at Acorn Manor Assisted Living. It's an assisted living for people who cannot take care of themselves anymore and need assistance with daily living. But we have a twist. So this is for people who love animals, have their own pets and cannot take their pets with them if they go somewhere else. So we are a pet friendly assisted living where people can bring their pets with them. And we know how people go into nursing homes, assisted living, and they start declining. And I felt I need to provide a home for them and their pets so both of them can come together. So Wind Fawn, I read about it when uh, somebody else did it in Japan. And I thought it's such a beautiful idea. As soon as I saw it, I was um, intrigued by it. So I had to go research it and uh, read um, what wind phones were. So wind phones are the concept that you have a phone that you can call your loved one on, people who have passed on. Instantly, I knew I wanted to come and see it in person. Most people have so many things they want to say to their loved one who has passed. I wanted to talk to my mom on the phone one more time because we used to talk on the phone all the time. They can talk it out loud and say things and people cry, people laugh. It's, it's beautiful. I was in there, I talked to my mom for a while. I told her to tell everybody I loved her, my grandma, my grandpa, and I told her how much I missed her and um, wishing she was here for the holidays. Christmas is a time when families get together and that's where we miss the most the people we have lost. I wasn't expecting to, you know, anything on the other end. I knew it was a one-way conversation, but just that opportunity to do that and have peace with that. Because I have an animal sanctuary and I rescue older animals, I have lost so many of them. And each one that passes takes peace of me. And I miss them and I talk to them. And I knew there's so many people out there that's going through the same thing, right? And I wanted to do two, one for humans and one for animals. And we have people who have come and talked to their pets who have passed away. And it's the same thing. Pets are family. It's definitely something um, I would share and continue to share. And I'm, I'm glad there's avenues like this that people can um, have their own experience and their own testimony to their experience with grief with their loved ones. Our loved ones are always around, and if they could find a way, they would let us know. But even if there's no confirmation, we can do this so they hear us and they know what's in our heart, what's going on in our life, and what we really want to say to them.